This is Pretend Farmer Girl, and it has been a while. I live up in Kotzebue, Alaska, and which is 30 miles above the Arctic Circle, and I've still done projects and stuff, but I just haven't had a chance to, or taken the time to post them as much. But I'm really excited about this, so I wanted to share it with you. This is the first phase of my journey with um, probiotics, lacto-fermentation. Um, there's been a lot of videos out there from other people's YouTube channels that I've scoured and watched over and over again. I have bought the book on um, the art of fermentation and I just want to tell you really quick um, this isn't everything that I've done so far but um, I've fermented a lot of um, cucumbers, onions, carrots, you know I did I just did some beets um, and so basically here's some cucumbers that I did um, they are in the ref refrigerator now, but I waited till it turned a little bit cloudy after a few days and put them in. This is my um, sauerkraut that I make all the time. This is new to me, which is kefir, and I bought I bought the um, grains, and this one is in the second fermentation with um, an, an organic orange. I cut a slice in there, so I will have some of that. Um, right now, I'm going to make I haven't really seen anything on this, but I am going to make what is sure to kick anything bad out of your system. I have um, ginger, a little bit of uh, cucumbers left over from my other batch. I have um, garlic and onion, and so I'm going to put all of that in, and then I'm going to pour the um, the salt water. And right now, I just did about a. Um, I just did about a, a uh, half of a quart with about three quarts of three fourths of a tablespoon of um, sorry about the video I don't have anything to help me here uh, three fourths of a um, tablespoon of salt so the salts already mixed it's so simple that's the thing that I love about this is this is already um, pre-mixed salt water you just pour let's see if I can get a better angle you pour the salt water over the vegetables, anything that you want to ferment, and I probably poured too much in there. And I have these uh, fermentation weights, but you can use a rock, you can use, I have another kind of fermentation, um, uh, something that goes on top. So that's it. That is it. And you just put it in the refrigerator. I mean, no, 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 sorry. You put it on the counter, um, you know, three to five days and um, I kind of have been using the gauge that when it turns cloudy, it's, it's pretty much ready or you can taste it as you go. Um, but anyway, um, stay tuned. I will keep you updated on my progress. This is Pretend Farmer Girl signing out.